Welcome back, guys, to Jared the Journeyman. Um, I believe this is the fifth video in the series that um, I'm putting on. And what we're doing is we're going over journeyman test questions that you will see on your test. Maybe they reference back to the NEC. So um, while we're going through this, make sure you highlight your book, take note of where these questions came from and what the questions look like. If you guys are getting something out of this, please give me a like or subscribe. Um, I'd like to get my account up a little bit and um, hopefully you guys are getting something out of this. So that be said, let's get going on this. And we'll get this shipper and we'll get this plan. All right, looks like we're getting me moved. We've got journeyman test question, <laughs> excuse me, 10 questions. And this is video number five. Let's, um, all right, in a commercial major repair garages where natural gas filled vehicles are repaired and ventilation is not provided, the area within 18 inches of the ceiling shall be classified as a blank location. And that's a class one division two area, uh, 515.3D and table 515.3D. Next one, an enclosure that supports a luminaire and is supported by an entire raceway shall not exceed blank in size. Remember, guys, a luminary is a light fixture. So what? how big in size? It should be 100 cubic inches. And that's in uh, 31423F. What maximum voltage between conductors is allowed to supply luminaires installed in dwelling units, so inside houses or apartments? And that's 120 volts, 2106A. An auto transformer is used to raise the voltage to more than blank volts as part of a ballast for, for supplying light units and shall be supplied only by a ground system. And that is 300 volts, NEC 410-138. Another one, we're acceptable were accessible to public flexible cords and cables used for temporary auto audio systems laid or run on the on the ground or on the floor shall be covered with approved non-conductive mat 640.45 so back there in 640 I believe we're doing uh, sound systems so that's where we'd find that 40 volt/ 277 volt overhead service conductors passing over Commercial areas not subject to truck traffic shall have a vertical clearance above grade of not less than blank, and that's 12 feet. You can find that in 230.24B2. Snap switches rated at 20 amps or less directly connected to aluminum conductors shall be listed and marked CO slash ALR. So what that's telling is it's rated for uh copper and aluminum. That's on 40414C. All right, electromotive forces that pushes one amp of current through a resistance of one ohm is known as one volt. There's not a article reference on that one. So that's just Ohm's law. You've seen that picture where somebody squeezing something through a little pinched area and it tells you amps and voltage and current and all that. That's what that means. Here we go. A clearly labeled emergency shutoff shall be installed at a point not less than blank feet away from a hot tub. And it's five feet. So 680.441. And let's go. Boxes that enclose devices or utilization equipment supplied by 12 or 10 AUG conductors shall have an internal depth not less than one and three sixteenths inches, three fourteen twenty four B four. Guys, that's it. That's uh, ten questions we just went through. Make sure those get highlighted. If you guys need any more help or would like to get a little bit deeper into this, I do have a Facebook group called the the Grid, and that is a group where. A bunch of guys trying to get their journeyman's license are coming together and we go over stuff. Um, 
questions they have and scenarios that they've seen that they need answering to. So um, if you like, scan the QR code and join that group. That is a paid group. Um, I think it's $27.99 a month. So that's like 93 cents a day. So we spend more on a on an energy drink, on a monster or whatever, Celsius or whatever to uh, to have, or we could be part of this community. I will show you the blueprint on what I used to get these uh, tests passed. I've taken tests in multiple states. So um, I do know a thing or two about these tests. Guys, that's all I have for now. Uh, thank you for watching. And again, please subscribe and be safe out there. Stop share.